Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a product review, which I haven't done in a super long time. So today we're gonna be um, reviewing a face mask that I bought. It is called Spa Scriptions Superstar Glitter Mask. So we're gonna see how this is. So this is the package it came in. I haven't opened it at all. It comes with the um, glitter peel off mask, which is infused with charcoal. And then it comes with a brush, a silicone tip for no mess precision. So we're gonna test this and see how it is. Um, you have to wear it for 20 to 30 minutes, which is actually a long time because usually face masks are no more than like 15. So we're gonna test this out and see how it goes. So let me just tie my hair. Oh, actually, I'll use a hair tie. Alrighty, let me, this is the glitter peel off mask. And then this is the brush that it came with. Yeah, so it is silicone. So we're going to just see how this, oh. Okay. Um, it has little stars and other little glitter stuff in it. Let me double check on the uh, instructions. It says to use, see tutorial on www.globalbeautycare.com or thoroughly clean and dry your face, which I did, with warm water. Uh, men, make sure to shave first. We recommend to do a patch test first. Spread evenly over face, avoiding eyes, hairline, and lips. Wear mask until completely dry. This may, may take 20 to 30 minutes. Gently peel off any downward or upward motion from outer edges. Rinse off all remaining residue with warm water. If you cannot peel off the mask, rinse it off with warm water. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Maybe it's like specifically for men, those instructions, but it's for both genders. So I'm going to use my mirror just so I can apply it. Um, I don't want to get any anywhere I don't okay let's see how this works I've never seen a silicone brush before so okay it just like sticks to it I guess okay oh my gosh it is very cool pretty cool though I like the brush yeah and the mask is very very glittery before I take it off I'll go in the Sun and see if I can shimmer like Edward Cullen alrighty I'm just gonna grab a baby clip and baby clip my hairs up here cuz I don't want to get it anywhere I don't want it oh my goodness all I don't know how thick I'm supposed to make this. Oh my gosh, it smells weird. It feels good with the, with the brush. I think this is gonna be my go-to face mask brush now. Should I put it over my piercing? I don't know. Okay, so this is how it looks so far. It is very glittery. It's really cool. I accidentally got hair in it. Oh, uh, awesome. Okay. It smells... I can't... Uh, it smells familiar. But I can't put my finger on it. So many baby hairs! Oh my gosh. Oh god, I need a sneeze! Okay, so this... Ah! I got it in my eyebrow. Here. The smell is so familiar, but I can't put my finger on it. It definitely smells like alcohol, <laughs> which I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Probably not. 
Okay, I'm just gonna leave that little part of my nose exposed because I don't want to cover my piercing. All right, I am done. Now my nose is super itchy. Oh my God. And this thing is dripping. Okay. Oh my God, do you see this? It's like dripping. I probably made it too thick because it's like dripping off of my face. Alrighty, well, we're gonna leave this on for 20 to 30 minutes and see how it is. Um, but my face is super itchy right now. Ugh, I can't put my finger on it. For some reason, it reminds me of like elementary school. It definitely smells like alcohol. This thing is, oh God. Like, I don't know if this is going to drip off my face or what. Okay, so that's what we're going to do. I'm going to make a timer for, we'll do 25 minutes. Hopefully that's long enough. Set me a timer for 25 minutes. Setting the timer. All right. Alrighty, so 25 minutes. We will check back and see how it is. But this is how it looks right now. You can see the stars and little other glitter particles in the face mask. And it, is, it does have um, charcoal. So that should take all the impurities out of my face. So we're going to see how... Um, oh my god, there's like one eyelash at the bottom that keeps getting caught. Stop it. Oh my god. Um, yeah, so we're going to see how it is in 25 minutes. Um, because my skin is... Lately, it has not been the best. So, we're going to see if this uh, helped at all. So yeah, I will see you guys in 25 minutes. Alright, you guys. It has been 25 minutes and... Um, I have come to the conclusion that the layers, or maybe, I don't know how I would call it. Do you, is that a, I don't know how that happened because I covered all parts of my cheek. Um, I have come to the conclusion that I put way too thick of a layer because it keeps dripping from my chin from here, it was like dripping onto my eyebrows. Um, like right here, it's dripping. Um, so I think the, the layers I did were way too thick. But if you notice like here, right here, it's already starting to like peel off. So I think like the layer closest to my skin dried. It's just the top layer that's still like wet. So I mean, it's at 20 to 20, it's at 20 to 30 minutes been 25 so I'm just gonna take it off and see how my skin is okay it's all right well I was hoping it come off in one piece but it doesn't look like that's happening all right let's see ah oh my gosh I'm gonna get all messy um <laughs> I don't I'm not gonna be able to take this off um, it's still way too wet from putting it on I would say leave a thin layer um, that way it'll come off cleaner because this does not want to come off yeah so this does not want to come off I'm gonna have to wash it with warm water so I'm gonna do that real quick but we'll see how my skin looks once i'm finished i took the face mask off and my face is all red because i was attempting to take off with warm water as the instructions said and it would not come off it was like liquidy not liquidy but like gooey but solid so it was like stuck to my face it would not come off hmm so i had to get a towel let me show you guys this towel Sorry, I am zooming in the wrong, zooming the wrong way. Oh my God, it's all over my hand. Okay, so. 
this towel nothing on that side this towel I used to uh, wipe off my face that is all the glitter it doesn't look like a lot but it's a lot and that was the only way of taking it off by like scraping it off my face because it wouldn't come off so in my opinion I do not recommend this yeah I I, hmm, I would not recommend this um, face mask I would definitely go with something from Lush because Lush you can never go wrong with they are amazing um, this one I wanted to test out because I know glitter um, face masks were like a thing but this one was very hard to take off um, it was kind of weird with the layering I was like when I was washing my face I was trying to like you know wash it off and then parts of it would be solid and I would be able to like take it off like how I did in the beginning but then the other parts would be like gooey and then like it would stick to my face and I couldn't take it off and then I had to use the towel to like scrape it off so I mean I guess my face is soft but if you don't mind the like hassle of taking it off because I was kind of like annoyed with with the whole process but i mean my skin looks okay if you're not subscribed i hope you guys um consider subscribing because i have lots of content coming out soon you can just hit the little subscribe button and the little bell notification button that way you get notified when i upload also i leave my social media platforms in my um, description i have my snapchat my twitter and my instagram which are all the same name which is the name of my channel, which makes it super easy to find me. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video, um, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, you guys.